Hey YouTube, it's Charisma and I'm here today to talk to you about the Sunny Isle Jamaican Black Castor Oil Pure Butter. And this one is the one with lavender. They actually have different kinds, um, but I picked the one with lavender because I love lavender. As you guys know by now, I love Sunny Isle products. Um, I basically switched over to Sunny Isle and these are my staple products. I use their shampoo, conditioner, um, leave-in, deep conditioner, and a couple of their styling products such as this. So I'm going to tell you how I feel about this, how I use this, and um, if I recommend it or not. Obviously I'm doing a video about it. but Okay, so for this I would say that this is a thick product. Um, I was um, very happy when I first used it because it reminded me of, you know, how you used to use grease back in the day, but it's actually not grease, it's castor butter. So it has Jamaican black castor oil in it, which is filled with so many um, beneficial properties. Um, it's good for stimulating hair growth, it's good because it's thick, you can use it as a sealer on your ends. Um, you can use this on your edges if you have issues with trying to regrow your edges. Um, here it says it stimulates hair growth. It's great for dry, brittle, damaged hair. Alleviates dry, itchy, flaky scalp. Sealant for dry hair. Ideal for dry, sensitive skin. So you can also use this on your skin. It says it helps with psoriasis and eczema. I have suffered with eczema. And, um, and I have actually put it on my eczema patches and it works really well. I just have one patch like on my foot um, and it helps. Um, it says it eases arthritic pain. So if you're suffering from arthritis, um, you can use this um, as well as fade scars. Uh, acne blemishes and stretch marks so if you also have the regular castor oil that's also good if you have arthritis pain and everything else but this actually comes in the form of a butter so what a better way to get it in if you don't really like liquids the butter is really good and I like it for my hair because one way that I use it is, you know, when I'm doing my styles. I did a wonderful style, a Bantu Not Out style on blow dried hair for headshots that I had to take. You guys know I'm a performer, so I took some new headshots um, the latter part of 2018. And I used this for my Bantu Knots. And when I took it out in the daytime, it helped to keep my Bantu Knots together. Like, you know, sometimes you put in product and um, you do your braid out twist outs or whatever and they don't last this helped to give me a bit of a hold and a shine but it also helped with any frizz that I had um, it really worked well and I'll insert a picture of my hair how it came out that day and I was so not knowing like what it was gonna come out like but it came out awesome Um, so that's one way I use it as a styler. Um, I also use it on my edges and I use it on my crown area being that castor oil promotes growth. Um, you know, I've recovered from crown area damage and some of you want me to do a video on that. I will do more to help whoever has issues with their crown and teach you what, teach you, what you can do to help um, repair your crown area. But I would say this is definitely a good start. Um, and to put on your edges. I also use it when I do the lock method, leave-in oil and cream. Some people do LC or leave-in cream oil. However you want to do it, you do it that way. But after I wash my hair and then I put on um, my leave-in, and then I may use um, coconut oil because my your hair absorbs coconut oil better. Um, and then I'll go in and put in this to seal it all in and it works wonders i mean for me i have porous hair so it goes into sealing filling the gaps and keep my hair moisturized and shiny and just really soft so that's why i like this as well what else can i say um like i said i use it on my eczema patch and it helps a lot with that um and the smell not gonna lie it smells like castor oil and then this since it has lavender you have the hint of lavender in it but I feel like the castor oil is overpowering the lavender which I don't have a problem problem with it I love natural 
products, if they smell earthy, I love it because that lets me know that I'm putting something healthy onto my hair and my body and I'm all about natural hair products. Um, what else can I say? You can use it as a styler, like if you want to do your buns and stuff like that and you need to slip down edges and you don't want to use gel, you can use it or you can put it first and then put the gel over it and that will really hold your hair in place. Um, I think it's wonderful. I really do. I have nothing bad to say about this except the fact that I cannot find this in my local beauty supply. I purchased this at TJ Maxx um, because their prices tend to be a little bit more cheaper. But I can't find it anywhere like at Target or Rite Aid or even the local beauty supply stores don't carry this. I think I have to go online. But Sunny Isle, if you're watching me, I've been promoting your products. I would appreciate some sponsorship. I would love to, um, you know, work with you guys um, to help to promote your products because I really love them. I use them and I believe in them and I highly recommend them. So, um, of course, um, I recommend this. If you were thinking about trying it, yes, I would say try it. It's a great sealer. It's a great, um, helps you to keep whatever moisture that's in your hair. Um, helps to um, maintain the moisture level it helps with dry scalp I do put some on my edges because on the right side I have a little issue with edges still I'm recovering but yeah um, it's a great sealant for your ends if you want to you know take care of your ends and put it on your ends it's great for your crown area it's great to use in the lock method um, I highly recommend it I use it and I love it I just wish I could find it I don't want to order online I just want to go in the store and pick it up or whatever mine is done so Sunny Isle if you're watching <laughs> anyway um guys thank you guys for watching please support my online store I sell headbands hair socks these this is the same thing as this except you do like that to get it to be a headband but you can wear it long like this where you put it on your head and your braids are cascading out I have children's sizes all different patterns and prints on my site, solid colors as well. I have satin um, head scarves that I make, yes I do. Um, and my satin bonnets that are reversible. Different colors and prints and stuff like that, they come in regular, oversized and oversized plus and I do customize my order. So go on over to the shop and check it out. I'm pretty sure you will find a pattern or a style you like and I do custom orders. Etsy.com slash shop slash charisma for you. Thank you guys for watching. I love you all. Bye.